guys, this is Guru from TechZ India. Last few weeks have been quite busy for the folks at Redmond. Microsoft has released their Windows Phone 8, Windows 8 and Microsoft Surface to the public. Today I'm going to be walking you through the top 10 features of Windows Phone 8. The number one feature. Windows Phone no longer works on Windows CE kernel. Windows Phone now works on Windows NT kernel. Now Windows Phone shares its kernel with Windows 8 NT kernel. Simply put, Microsoft has kept the beautiful live screen as it is and has changed everything that runs it behind. Now what does that mean? This is a benefit to the uh, developers and application writers as they can write application that can be easily ported between Windows Phone and Windows Phone 8. Microsoft has now extended support for native codes and probably this is the biggest news for developers. This will help native code programmers to bring their application to the marketplace faster. They can even write applications faster. This is the number two feature. The number three feature, the home screen. The lifetimes of Windows Phone 7 was the biggest breakthrough in smartphone technology after the iPhone and Android. The beautiful light tiles now has more power and can be resized into three built-in sizes. This allows the user to customize their home screen with the smallest tile being just an icon with a notification and the next size which is similar to that of a Windows Phone 7 and the large tile which will now show notification and also display content according to the app. The number four feature, Rooms. Windows Phone 7 had hubs. With Windows Phone 8, Microsoft has brought Rooms. But what is Rooms? Rooms is a feature with which people can form their own rooms for family, or for work, or for friends, where you can personally share content such as calendar, photo uploads, messages, emails with the people in that room. You can send text messages and mails to all the person in the room at once. But what's special in here? A person in a room can exactly see the same content and notification others see in that room. This becomes more awesome because sharing has been now extended support to iPhone and Android but to a certain extent. The number five feature, lenses. Lenses are another great feature of Windows Phone 8. It brings all the camera and photo applications that are installed on your phone to one place. In the cam, you can choose what lens to use before you take a picture. Now, Microsoft has had few applications that are already in the marketplace, but soon many will follow. The shutter speed is dramatically improved in Windows Phone 8, and it is very fast and thanks to its hardware. The number six feature, the hardware limitations. Microsoft was heavily criticized for Windows Phone 7 hardware limitations, but now that is a word of past. Hardware limitations are now gone and Windows Phone now has support to resolutions up to HD. Not only that, Microsoft has also increased the hardware capability and now Windows Phone phones can run on multi-cores. This makes Windows Phones extremely fast. All the applications load faster and the user experience has dramatically become more smooth. It exactly stands to what people call Windows Phone buttery smooth, but now it's more smoother. The number seven feature. This might be looking as a small feature or this might turn out to be a very small thing for you out there, but Windows Phone 7 lacked it. The USB mass storage and synchronization. The USB mass storage and synchronization has been simplified now and synchronization between data from the PC and data on your phone has become so easy that you can drag and, drag and drop files from PC to phone and vice versa. This is more beautiful because Windows Phone 7 was not able to synchronize with any other software except than Zune, but now Windows Phone 8 can synchronize with iTunes also. The number 8 feature, DataSense. DataSense is a feature where if a user inputs his internet data plan, Windows Phone automatically understands and optimizes the data usage of that user on his Windows Phone. 
It automatically optimizes and adjusts how much data should be used while he is browsing and there is a live tile which actually displays how much data has been used and how much data is remaining. DataSense is a great feature and this is our number 8 feature. The number 9 feature of today's top 10 features is Kids Carter. Now this is one feature which no other operating system has till now and Microsoft should be given all credit because of this. This is the Kids Corner. Now a user can customize his Windows Phone with Kids Corner which allows him to see what applications do their kids need to see and what applications should be blocked. Last but not the least feature today, the number 10 feature and that is the new lock screen of Windows Phone. The new lock screen has the ability to show notifications up to five applications and the wallpaper can also be now live. What does that mean? Applications such as Facebook can now make use of the live wallpaper on Windows Phone 7 and that can show a collage of photos that the user has uploaded onto his Facebook account and applications such as ESPN can now go use this feature and show live weather updates on the lock screen. Applications such as weather from AccuWeather will now show the live weather on the screen. This was my brief roundup of the top 10 features of Windows Phone 8. These were some of the features which might change game for Microsoft and Windows Phone 8 has more become uh, competitive with Android and iOS and this no longer stays as a dark horse in this smartphone war. The beautiful OS has just become more beautiful. Please give a thumbs up if you like this video and stay subscribed to Taxi India. You can also follow us on facebook.com slash Have a great and safe day. Bye-bye.